So the Pentagon is getting dragged deeper into this immigration crisis. The Obama administration looking for ways to care for thousands of illegal immigrant children and now ordering the military to take care of it. Shannon Bream is live in Washington. So just how many unaccompanied minors are being housed at military bases, Shannon? Well, Martha, as you can imagine, it is changing hour by hour. But here is what we do know right now from the Defense Department. Lackland Air Force Base in San Antonio, Texas, can house up to 1,200 children. There are roughly 1,150 1, there now. At Ventura Naval Station in California, they've got capacity for 575. They have 450. And at Fort Sill in Oklahoma, they've also got room for 1,200 children and are just about at that limit. We are also told the Pentagon does not want to play an extended role in caring for these children and that the Defense Department plans to cap the number of days it can hold the children at 120, Martha. So lawmakers now want to see what's happening on these bases. Will that be allowed? Well, several have tried. There have been mixed results. Most notably, Oklahoma Congressman Jim Bridenstine, who has served as a Navy pilot, said he was denied access to Fort Sill, which is in his district. When he tried to go check things out for himself, he was told he could make an appointment three weeks into the future. By the way, the media has been invited to visit Fort Sill to check things out. But with these conditions, no recording devices will be allowed, no questions will be allowed during the tour, and no interacting with staff and children at the shelter. As you can imagine, there is significant pushback to those arrangements. That tour is scheduled for Thursday. We'll see how many in the media want to take them up with those conditions in yeah. place. Martha. Shannon, before I let you go, I mean, is the Pentagon, were they taken by surprise with this? Or did they know that, you know, if something like this were to happen, that they would be responsible for housing these children? Well, it's interesting because when we've heard DHS Secretary Jay Johnson talk about this even weeks ago, he said, we saw this brewing. He said he knew about it months ago during his confirmation hearings, were, which were at the end of last year. So the administration has certainly been on notice. And I have talked to some folks who were in um, the National Reserve and that kind of thing. And they've said they have been told, some of them, by their leadership, hey, you know, you need to be prepared. We may be calling you up to active duty to help deal with this situation uh, so they know the potential is out there. Martha. Mm -hmm. Shannon, thank you very much. Mm -hmm.